If you love someone, like truly love someone, I don't think that ever goes away. But what does change is your perspective on the relationship and the dynamic. Watch Noah Centineo give his fans some amazing advice on just about everything from managing stress to approaching your crush to getting over heartbreak and so much more. Stop what you're doing right now, you guys, because Noah is being cuter than ever. And that's saying a lot because, well, he's pretty darn cute, like all the time. But today we're gushing over his latest interview that's actually a Q&A with Glamour Magazine. But for this particular video entitled Live Life Advice with Noah Centineo, Noah is answering fan questions by providing some of his own wisdom in regards to some very important questions about life and love and everything in between. The video begins with Noah announcing the fun vid and telling viewers, quote, I have absolutely no grounds to be giving anyone advice on anything. Uh, okay, we've seen your tweets. We know what you're capable of, Noah, but nice try. The first question came from Twitter user Stream After Laughter, who needed some advice on approaching a cute guy in a restaurant and asking for his number without, quote, failing miserably. Noah was quick to remind the tweeter that, quote, good things come out of failure, but he also encouraged her to just go for it. I couldn't help but notice that I would love to go out to coffee with you or go out to a restaurant with you. You should just ask them out. Count to three and then just do it. Now, I was a huge fan of this next tweet, which posed the question if 26 was too old for a 22-year-old. Twitter user at Gabrielle Jr. said she was, quote, asking for a friend, but we're on to her, and so is Noah. But he did have the best answer, and you guys will see why I'm a big fan of his response. Uh, no, it's actually a little young for a 22-year-old like myself. So he's saying I have a chance. As the vid continues, we find out Noah is a Harry Potter fan, he's read all the books, and he actually reads a lot, which we found out by his extensive recommended reading list. He has a wide variety of music on his playlist, and he thinks romance is defined by caring for someone. He also has solid advice for managing anxiety, which includes finding time to do things you like to do, like taking a bath or getting back to your interests in between daily stresses. So basically, he's becoming more and more husband material by the second, and definitely best friend material. But our hearts really melted when he gave some sound advice for getting over a heartbreak. And for me, one of the best ways to, you don't really get over someone, but to move through and past someone is to really focus on yourself. Rediscover yourself, do things that you like to do, things that make you happy, things that make you feel empowered uh, and inspired. So you guys know what this means. If you happen to ask Noah for some friendly advice recently, he might have an answer for you. And if that's the case, then jealous. Drop your thoughts on Noah's Q&A down in the comments section. We can gush about Noah together on Instagram. Find me at Major Freeze. Now you guys can click right over here for another brand new video and be sure to subscribe to all of our channels. Thanks so much for watching. I'm your girl, Sinead DeFries, and I'll see you guys next time.